Hello friends, in my previous video I showed you how to enable sending images in a chatting application created using Firebase storage in Sketchware. Now in this video I will show you how to enable deleting messages at any particular position in this chatting application. So let's start. Here this is the app which I created in my previous video. It contains a list view which is a custom view, which is a custom list view and its custom view is this child, child.xml. Now I will just show you how this child.xml looks. The child.xml contains an image view 1 and a text view 1. Now in, a, in a order to enable deleting messages, I will be adding a linear edge and then I will put this text view inside this and I will put an image here. For this text view, I will set this weight as 1 and for this image view which is image view 2 I will select this image I see delete black and for this image I will set the height as match parent so this will be the delete button now let's move back to view area move back to main.xml this contains a button 1 which is for picking images it contains image view 100 for displaying the picked image then edit text 1 for writing the messages and it has button 2 for sending the messages. In on create, I have set, an, I have set a number variable image to 0, means no image is selected. Now on button 1 click, I use file picker to pick files to pick images and when images are picked then I set the number variable image to 1, means image is picked and I display the image in image view 100 and I save the file path of that image in image path in the string image path. Now on button 2 click if no image is selected then I push the message from edit text 1 to Firebase TV. If any image is selected then I upload the file path of that image or I upload the image from the file path to Firebase storage. And once the image is uploaded to storage, that is on upload success, I push the message from edit text 1 and the URL of the uploaded image, which is download URL, to the Firebase TV component. And then I set this image, set the number variable image back to 0. This is on upload success. Now next is on child added. Once the data is added to Firebase DB, I get the data to map list and display it in list view. After that is on bind custom view. In on bind custom view, I display all the messages from list map in text view 1 and I display all the images in map list in image view 1. And that is only when the map list contains the key image at that position. So this is what I created in my previous video. Now in order to enable deleting, I will first go to Firebase DB on child added. Here I will use this block add child key to list string list. Here I have created a new list string. So I will be using this block add child key to listing list. Now next is on bind custom view. In on bind custom view I will use this block when view clicked and here I will select when image view 2 clicked. Image view 2 is the delete button. So when this button is clicked first I will delete the data from Firebase DB component. So here I will use this block Firebase DB delete key get at position of list string list and after this I will delete that position of the list string delete at position of list and if I have to delete the uploaded image from Firebase storage then I will use this if then block similar to this block so I will use this if then block and here I will just copy this 
and put it here so if the map list contains the key image only in that case I will delete it from Firebase storage so I will use this block Firebase storage delete file URL the URL is stored in map list using key image so I will just copy this and put it here get value at position key image of map list this will be for deleting data from firebase storage now that's all in on bind custom view next i move back to components here when the deleting of image is successful if the image is successfully deleted from firebase storage then in that case i will just toast a message image deleted and after this I will use this I will add this component firebase db on child removed means once the deleting is successful from firebase database then after that I will just refresh it by using this block Firebase DB get children to list map map list and after this list view set list custom view data list map and list view refresh data that's all is required for enabling deleting in a chat application now let's check this okay here in this chat application you can see that now there is a delete button at each position and if I have to delete any message at any particular position like suppose if I want to delete this grade I'll just click on this delete button and it will delete grade from there if I have to delete this message I will just click on this delete and it will delete that message if I have to delete any message with image like if I want to delete this I'll just click here it will delete that and after some time it will show the message image deleted and if I add some new image from photos I can still I can add some new images here like this one okay and after this image is added I can delete other images here you can see I can delete any image or message I want 